good evening ladies and gentlemen and welcome the rest of the country is waiting for it to become 8 pm so that they can enjoy the full moon but those of us here we already have the full moon on stage in the form of sri kashyap mahesh in our one of the sad things in our educational system is that many children who are very brilliant they opt to go for medicine or engineering if they don't get through they try to make a go of it in chartered accountancy or mba or something like that if they still don't make it they go for bed and something like that even they are not intelligent enough to qualify for that they go for home science there also they don't get admission as the last option they take up music <laughs> as the subject and if we go and visit music departments in many educational institutions we find a very sad state of affairs as a very refreshing change to that is sri kashyap mahesh who is one of the most brilliant <laughs> minds of the younger generation he is a multifaceted person he draws beautiful pictures and he is very techno savvy so once when he drew pictures of temples online the founder of microsoft bill gates actually wrote to him and gave him a gift so that is the level of his reach he is a native telugu speaker but he is very passionate about tamil so these days i'm again he's just in his mid 20s he's a young boy though his artistry is much more than uh, mid 20s it's a fashion among the younger generation children be it from kerala or tamil nadu or kannada like if we are making a dosa we have to turn it flip flop several times when they speak they will keep flip flopping between their mother tongue and english sometimes they'll say the same sentence half in malayalam or tamil and Im immediately give the translation in english while kashyap mahesh so just to listen to him speak tamil is if you will fall in love with tamil if you hear him speak it's pure classical beautiful chaste and wonderful tamil which my veena gurus generation people used to speak so in every way and maharaja swajitrinal also was a linguist he has composed songs in sanskrit telugu tamil brij bhasha malayalam manipravalam so he is the right person to give a concert today please welcome kashyap mahesh so if the singer is a superstar then there is no choice the violinist has to be a superstar also so in the form of sri anantha krishna his guru from the festival from the time this festival started 18 years ago we never have a festival without sri s varadarajan who we are all waiting for tomorrow he is training several others in the same fantastic bani which he in turn learned from professor tv gopalkrishnan actually kashyap mahesh has learned music from tv gopalkrishnan also they have that connection also but just the many carnatic violinists from the previous generation they would play for the singing but very few people like ms gopalkrishnan only have fully explored the possibilities of the instrument be it in the bowing or the fingering or the dynamics or the virtuosity and anantha krishnan tops the list of superstars who can, the violin is, is a slave in his hand as you will see now i am a big fan of anantha krishnan but i still haven't dared to sing with him because whatever we sing he will play two steps more <laughs> so please welcome sri anantha krishnan now on the mridangam we have sri neveli venkatesh another beloved figure so normally he always plays for tomorrow's superstar sanjay subramaniam so but today he's taken up my, my uh, very sportingly taken up my invitation of mixing and matching little bit and he's senior to kashyap mahesh but he's again one of those very magnanimous and wonderful people who will give his 100% in fact the same team they played Uh, for navaratri and after the concert to so impressive i didn't have anything else to say that 
I would love the same team to play again at Kudra Malik and they readily accept it. So please welcome David Venkatesh. He's a very difficult artist to get because like we go from Trivandrum to Kollam or Cochin, he'll go to Switzerland and France and all the time he has a very, very thriving international career also. It's always a pleasure to have him. And on the Khatam, we have another full moon in the form of Manu Runikrishnan, who delighted us yesterday. And Manu is again one person whom it's very difficult to call him all the way to Trivandrum and let him go after one day. So he has to pay, play minimum two days. And uh, they have played together very few times only. And today we'll have a wonderful combination. In them. So please welcome Manu Runikrishnan. And with all the gentlemen in white, we have a colorful lady in the form of Bhagya Lakshmi. It's a very rare and special thing to find women taking up a percussion instrument. And she is one of the top, if not the top, female percussionist I've heard. She's played here many times before. And sometimes when the gentlemen percussionist, they try to impress people with very, very complicated mathematical things. She will play something simple, but it will be so pleasing that after the concert, you find the biggest crowd of people waiting to meet the artist around Bhagya Lakshmi. Okay. Please welcome Bhagya Lakshmi. And then if all the men are in white, that is not fair. So we have one colorful gentleman in the form of Sri Anitta Patanapha. And I request those of you with mobile phones to kindly keep them in the silent mode. Thank you.